Hey guys, it's Katie and today I'm going to show you how to create a custom email template in Kartra. But before we get started, if you're not subscribed um, to my channel here on YouTube, I would love for you to subscribe and become a part of um, the tribe here on YouTube. So um, also, if you want to learn more about Kartra or uh, making money online, um, go ahead and check out the links below this video and um, I provide you know some of the resources there as well so let's get started so the first thing that you're gonna want to do is log in into your Kartra account if you don't have one um, as I said um, you can find the link below this video where you can learn all about Kartra what it is and what you can do um, with it to build your online business so um, I am logged in into my Kartra account and I'm under connections tab here and under broadcast so what I'm going to do is show you how to um, create an email template so and it's not going to be just an email template but your own um, or your custom email template that you can use to send out email to your list anytime you want so um, let's go ahead and click on broadcast right here um, on the green button and let's just give it a name and click create okay the next thing that you want to do is click send by email and then um, I'll just go ahead and put in my custom email address here and the email address that I have created uh, for myself to use uh, within Kartra or the reply to a send from email um, I uh, went to GoDaddy and just created a custom email there um, but also you can create it with HostGator or any kind of hosting company out there and I definitely recommend using your custom email right here when you are sending out you know, your broadcasts because if you use like Gmail or Hotmail or something like that I've noticed that um, the deliverability rates um, so like um, the amount of people who open your emails are not as high as when you have your custom email um, here so let's click save and then save and next and then save and next and then single email so here what I would do is go to um, instead of basic to advanced and then I'll put in the subject line so the next thing I usually uh, change uh, this color right here to a white color as well but it's really up to you how you want you know your email background to look so the next thing I go to design templates so what I'm going to do I will create an email template and then I will save it so I can reuse it you know in my other broadcast that I'm going to be sending out for example um, I will you know just show you a quick example so when I go to my templates right here I have a few templates that I've saved and that I am um, you know that I can reuse for my emails that I'm, send that I'm sending out to my list so for example let's just take um, this one and just drag it here and you can kind of see it um, as an example here so I have my email text here um, or body text and then I have um, um, on the bottom I have like a little footer that I have with my um, image and some of the information and um, the buttons here to connect with me on social media platforms so I will go ahead and show you how to create something similar to this and um, so that way you can just create it and then uh, click on save as template and then you'll be able just to just you know go to my templates and then drag your template here and just edit this text right here and um, be able to send out an email to your list with your footer that you have here as well as the social media links right here so let's go ahead and create one from scratch I will just um, get rid of these here and show you how I've created that so I will go ahead and um, click on text and just drag the text block right here so the next thing what I want to do is I want to have a footer so um, I will go ahead and click on content and then find an image or content piece that I want to or block that I want to put in here and edit 
so I will just choose um, this one right here and just drag it and drop underneath the text so the next thing what I want to do is I want to edit this text right here um, so I will delete it and just say like uh, my name so and I will just um, edit this text right here first So what I want to do with this button and this text is I want uh, people, you know, who are interested in learning um, about creating or setting up a an, an online business that they will, you know, that they have an opportunity to click this button and go learn more about how they can do that. So um, I will go ahead and edit this button and just click um, yes, show me the video and then um, I will also add a link where they would go to actually learn more about um, setting up a, a profitable online business so I will go ahead and add the link I can also edit the um, the color of uh, the button here So the next thing that we're going to do is put an image here. So if you want uh, your image to be um, like in a circle, like I showed you before, uh, what I did, I went to canva.com uh, and I've created that image um, in Canva before I actually placed it into Kartra. So if you don't know what Canva is, it's basically a um, place where you can edit any kind of picture you want or create any kind of image like book covers, animated social media, you know, posters, t-shirts, websites, anything for your blog or whatever um, design that you need, you can create it here. So um, just check out the link below if you want to learn more about Canva and you can simply create a free account there. Um, if you would like, you can also upgrade. They give you a lot more options when you upgrade, but um, it's free to use, you know, to start off with, you can um, use it for free. So once you're in Canva, Go ahead and click create a design and just do um, custom dimensions and um, do 400 by 400 and click create design. So once you're here, you will go ahead and click on elements and you will find frames and just grab the circle and drag it here. And um, that's if you want your image or your picture to be in the circle like I did on my other template that I've showed you guys. So once you're done with that, go ahead and um, go to uploads and click upload. And you'll just upload your photo that you wanna use for that um, email template. So you can either create a circle like that with your picture, or you can just use it without any kind of, um, you know, frame or anything like that. So let me just try it like this. All right, and the next thing what we're going to do is just um, name it and um, just click on the download button and click download. Okay, so I'm just going to go ahead and drag it to the desktop and go back to Kartra and I'll click on edit here and upload image and just upload our image in there. All right, so it's in here. And the next thing that I want to do is um, I will go ahead and add the social media links below here as well. So that way, if people want to connect with me on social media, they can also, you know, have the opportunity to click those buttons and connect with me on social media or learn about me. You know, if they have any questions, they can also ask me there too. So um, let's go ahead and click or find a footer here. And let's find something that would um, match this here. I will go ahead and click um, and drag this one. And 
and I will just delete this part right here and all I'm gonna do I'm just gonna edit these buttons here and um, make sure it's all connected to my social media platforms so I'll just go to my desktop and I will um, copy this link here and simply paste it in here all right so this one is connected and I go to Twitter and edit I will make sure it's the same size as the previous one just copy this link and um, I will go ahead and paste it here and that's it the next one is LinkedIn but what I want to do is I want to change these to um, Instagram and um, YouTube so I will go ahead and look for an image that is um, like an Instagram image but to make sure it matches the color as well so Instagram logo gray I'll go to images so I will go ahead and choose an image and save it and then what I'm gonna do is click edit and then upload image and choose this image and as you can see it's a little bit higher and it doesn't really match or um, it's a little higher than these images here so in order to fix that what I'm gonna do is I will just go ahead and open this image and I'm just gonna um, take a screenshot um, of this image to make sure it's the same you know the same amount of space around the image so in order to take a screenshot on Mac I usually click command shift and 4 and then it allows me to take a screenshot so let's go ahead and um, take a qu quick screenshot here all right and then just go back and we will um, re-upload the image again but the one that we just took a screenshot of all right so it's um, a little bigger so we're gonna make it um, smaller all right so let's find a um, YouTube logo okay let's click on this one right here and save um, this image and then go back to this one and upload image okay so we, when we go back we will go ahead and um, add the links to those images that we just added let's grab this one and add it here and then we will go ahead and edit the Instagram one as well let's copy this make sure it works and paste it in here all right as you can see the um, that these images are a little bit smaller than these are and a little bit farther um, apart so what I'm gonna do I'm gonna try to find different images for these and uh, see what we can um, do to improve this you know situation here let's find a Facebook logo in gray all right this seems like it's a good one so let's go ahead and save this one Facebook logo all right let's see upload image all right um, so it's a little bit bigger let's make it a tiny bit smaller let's try to find a Twitter logo that would match better alright I feel like um, these match pretty good and they are all you know in the same line so let's just make sure we have the links connected this one has a link um, this one doesn't so let's go ahead and uh, and get the Twitter link 
and paste it in here. And then let's just check if Instagram it also has a link as well as YouTube. And it looks great. So the next thing what we're gonna do, we can edit this text um, as well. So uh, we can say like, hey, it's Katie. And then just say like, um, text goes here. So far, um, I love it, except I don't really like the, the button color. So let's go ahead and change the button color. Okay, and let's make the text uh, black. Okay, I feel like I like this a lot more. Um, and let's go ahead and send a test email to make sure all the buttons work and everything works and how it looks in the email. So uh, let's click on send test email and click send test. All right, I will go ahead and open the email. All right, so here's the email. It looks great. Um, if I would want to edit anything, I, I can also edit and um, you know exactly how I want it. Let's say they um, read my email and it's like a value email that I've sent out and they do want to learn about what I do, more about me and how to start an online business. Um, they can go ahead and click um, this button here. Yes, show me the video. It's going to take them to my website where they can learn more about setting up a profitable online business. Um, so, and if they want to connect with me on any of these social media accounts or prop platforms, um, they can just click on the links that I have for them under my picture. So all the links seems uh, to be working. So that's it. Um, for this video, um, what I'm going to do it, you know, when I send out my emails, I obviously will, um, you know, put the text or the email body text inside this email and um, just use this template to send out my emails. So in order to save this template, what you need to do and make sure don't forget to do that, of course, because that way you, you will have it in your um, templates here. Um, so what we're going to do is click save as template and there you go your template has been saved and in order to find this template when you're sending it out an email with Kartra by using Kartra to your list you just go ahead and click on my templates here and here is going to be the template so you'll just you know click and drag it to the side here and just put in your email and everything else will be already created and set for you so um, and then you'll just obviously send out your email. So that's it for this video. Um, again, I've showed you how to create your own custom email template in Kartra. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Go ahead and click thumbs up if you enjoyed it um, and if you got value from it. And also let me know how it goes with your um, creation of your personal custom email template down in the comments below or if you have any questions whatsoever go ahead and let me know in the comments below. And I look forward to seeing you in the next video. Again, if you want to learn more about what I do, um, go ahead and check out the link below this video and subscribe if you have not subscribed yet. I look forward to provide a lot more value to you on this channel. All right, I'll talk to you later. Blessings.